connections in tandem represent the IoT device that is sending data to tandem streams. Before a user can create a connection or connections with the batch import function, numeric parameters must be created and associated to a classification in the facility template and then applied to the facility. To begin, click Create in the Streams panel and name the connection. Then within the Properties panel, assign the corresponding classification. Connections are treated the same as tagged assets in that the parameters are only associated with their classification. Once classified under the Relationship section of the Properties panel, users have the option to assign the connection to a host. This can be assigned now or at any time in the future. A host can be any element or space in tandem, but users will want to assign the connection to either a space or element from which that connection is feeding data from. And if relevant to the connection, a space or multiple spaces can be assigned. The more information associated with a connection, the more informed technicians will be. If device data has already been sent to the connection, a workflow that we will not cover in this video, Mapping can be defined between the incoming data and the tandem parameters. Note that if different classifications are used on different connections, associated parameters will vary and mapping parameters will need to be done each time a connection is classified with a new class. This is because not all connections feed the exact same facility data. Mapping parameters can only be done after stream data for a classified connection has been sent to tandem and users have to refresh their browser after. Once properly set up, charts and heat mapping will populate, providing a visual representation of the facility's operational data.